well rested and just landed. Yes. Today on Logan Lee Adventures. Through immigration with only one empty page left in my passport, we are now in India. It's my 60th country I've ever been to and Yeroon's 50th country, making it a huge milestone for us both. Another great thing about traveling business class is that... Oh, look at this. So this right here is a priority tag. So our luggage is the first one to get off the plane, first one to arrive before any other luggage. We picked it up. Hi. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, good. First thing first, to check in and drop off all our things at the Crown Plaza New Delhi. Crown Plaza is one of our favorite chains of hotels around the world, and for luxury that is comfortable, we always can rely on a few nights at the Crown Plaza. Yeah. <laughs> Aww. He's going to poo. He doesn't want me to see him. <laughs> We had taken plenty of tuk-tuks when we were just in Sri Lanka, so these mini mobiles became Yurun's and I's main mode of transportation while navigating the streets of New Delhi. As landmarks like Kano Place passed by us, it was clear to me that this was an easy and smooth way to get around an overwhelmingly packed city. The city has a population of over 25 million people, making it the second most warm city after Mumbai and most packed urban agglomeration in the country. Just finished your meal, we got this. I think that's supposed to clean our mouth. I don't know if we just chew and swallow or we chew and spit out. <laughs> what does it taste like? Sweet? As we were in New Delhi just in time for Independence Day, the rambasha streets of the nation's capital was filled with music, parades, and spectacle of celebration. No matter where we walked, there was festive in the air.
So we're at Jantar Mantar, which is in the middle of New Delhi. And, but look, it's a heart symbol. With my girlfriend. Yeah, with like, with his girlfriend, is what we've been telling all of our tic tic drivers. <laughs> Yantar Mantar was built in 1724 by Raja Jai Singh II of Jaipur in Delhi. Yantar Mantar of Delhi is an astronomical observatory with masonry instruments. All these instruments can be used for voracious astronomical calculations. I quite like this place. Oh, it's just weird. <laughs> and the colors of red and peach. But as you can see, the sky is actually blue, so the pollution is more cleared up, and we actually have blue skies. But the thing with that is, is that it's hot as fuck. <laughs> Hotter than usual as fuck. But I'm still enjoying this site. It's a really cool astrological and archaeological site as well. It is even used by modern day scholars to ascertain the location of the heavenly bodies in our universe. Yes, thank you. Hello India Gate. Its official name is Delhi Memorial, originally called All India War Memorial, dedicated to the troops of British India who died in wars fought between 1914 and 1919. <laughs> now we made it to what I must say is my favorite piece of architecture in New Delhi, the Bahi Lotus Temple. The structure is made up of pure white marble. The architect Farubras Saba chose the lotus as a symbol common to Hinduism, Buddhism, Jainism, and Islam. Adherents of any faith are free to visit the temple and pray or meditate. Guys, it feels so good to be back into our hotel. So we're gonna head straight back up and just really relax. I think we're gonna go for a swim and just, you know, just chill, just chill a bit. Enjoy the AC, <laughs> enjoy this beautiful hotel that we're back in. <sighs> you know what time it is? It's Game of Thrones time. So let me just use this electric controller to lazily turn, well, pull the curtains back. Look at that. Push the right button just once. I think it's out of battery. Second Yeah. Ooh, so cozy. Big white bed. We stretch as much as we want. Ah, oh, there we go. This huge ass TV screen. Another great thing about staying at the Crown Plaza, uh -huh, amazing room service. And your room just happened to surprise me with ordering these snacks. Thank you. This one is uh, the masala tea Indian, mm -hmm. black coffee, hot milk. Oh, how sweet! Well, this is a nice surprise. Mm -hmm. This is such a nice surprise. Oh, breakfast and lunch. Yeah. This has been so far our first whirlwind day in India's massive metropolitan capital. Subscribe to my channel for more adventures with Yurun and I. Give this video a like and leave a comment below on your thoughts of India so far. We're gonna cool down from this heat in our pool, but in our next video, we have more adventures in the land of spices. <laughs>